on to question two now. Millie bakes cakes and sells them in the local market. She has 28 eggs overall and she needs four eggs to make each cake. How many cakes can she make? Well, let's divide in. So she needs, she can bake seven cakes with the 28 eggs. On to part B now. Five and seven are as the ratio of butter to sugar in each filling. If she has 2.4 kgs of filling, how many grams of sugar does she need to make that filling? Okay, so let's look at the numbers here. We firstly need to convert to grams, because the answer is in grams. So let's convert. Okay, so multiply 2.4 by 1,000, we can get 2,400 grams. What we need to do now is get one part. So if we have five and seven, add them together and divide into the total. So let's do that. Five plus seven is 12. And 12 into 2,400 will give us 200 grams. Now over here, we can factor up by the seven ratio, which applies to the sugar. So she needs 1,400 grams of sugar. Part C now, there's two offers available. Special offer A, one bag is 350, but you get two for the price of three here. So all she really needs here to make up a total of six kgs of flour would be four bags of the 350 as the four will cover six, six kgs. And on the other side, we have 20% off. So we're going to multiply the 4.5 by four to bring us up to six and then we'll take the 20% off. So let's see how it works out. Okay, so there are the figures. Four bags okay, is required over here. The price of four bags and she will get six bags. So that will work out as 14 euros. And even with 20% off over here, because we have four bags of 150, um, and that will give us 20 euros. Take 20% off. Okay, so we're gonna get 16 euros. So offer A is better.